Hello, I am Sri from CBTU. Welcome to the Ethical Hacker Training Course based on CEH Certification Program by EC Council. Module Network Scanning Section Introduction to Network Scanning After footprinting, hacker gets fair idea about the target organization's network and its protection system. Network scanning is information gathering mainly for the purpose of security assessment or performing attack. Network scanning includes port scanning, SSDP scanning and vulnerability scanning. A port scan is a method used by the intruders to discover the services running on the target machine. Hacker uses this info in attack phase to gain unauthorized access to a system. The purpose of network scanning a target is to find live hosts, open ports, services running on the target host, vulnerabilities, weakness in the operating system or application, exploit vulnerabilities during the attack phase, make profile of the target system or network, profile includes IP address range, servers, DNS, network infra, operating system and services running there, enumeration phase, collecting routing info, network access, SNMP data, perimeter protection methods and Post protection methods, etc. SSDP is a simple service discovery protocol, a network protocol based on IP suite for advertisement and discovery of network services and presence information. It accomplishes this without the assistance of DHCP, DNS, or without static configuration of a network host. SSDP is the basis of discovery protocol of Universal plug and play that is UPnP and is intended for use in residential or small office environments. It is a text based protocol based on HTTP U. It uses UDP as the underlying transport protocol. Services are announced by the hosting system with a multicast addressing on UDP port number 1900. In IPv4, multicast addresses 239-255-255-250 and SSTP or IPv6 uses the address FF0X colon colon C for all scope ranges indicated by the X. In 2014, it was discovered that SSTP was being used in DDoS attacks known as SSTP reflection attack with amplification. DDoS is distributed denial of service. Many devices have a vulnerability in the UPnP software that allows an attacker to get replies from port number 1900 to a destination address of their choice. With a botnet of thousands of devices, the attacker can generate sufficient packet rate, occupy bandwidth to saturate links, causing the denial of service. That is DOS attack. These are some of the popular network scanning tools. We have many multi-purpose tools which does scanning, monitoring, analysis and remediation for vulnerabilities as well. These are the open source network monitoring tools. Nagios, Cacti, Isinga, Shinken, Jabbix, OpenNMS, etc. These are commercial network monitoring tools. Splunk, SolarWinds, Kapsa, OpenVAS, etc. Most of these have a free editions which can be tried and they will have some limitations. Full version can be tried as offered by the respective organization. Thanks for watching.